Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Alicia. In today's video, I'm going to share with you ways to be productive and organized. So first, as I always say in my videos, start doing yoga and it will not only help you to stay fit but also it clears your mind and body and all the negative thoughts you are dealing with. Second, choose your clothes wisely. It is also something that I always say in my videos. So for more productive and organized day, wear formal or such clothes that gives you vibes of working. Next, plan your day by making a to-do list will help you to be organized and you'll know what are your works. Fourth, whenever your work is completed, immediately clean your study table and it will help you to stay organized. And it will also decrease your workload. Is always keep in mind why are you studying because why is important and if you don't have a reason to find it and if you have so don't make it look like small like if I want to study Japanese only to watch anime so it's not the only reason don't make it look like that this reason is not important no reason is big or small so keep in mind whatever your reason is Sixth, always clean your study table and the room where you are studying. And this will not only help you to stay productive and organized but also helps you to stay motivated. Next, don't leave your study table again and again cause this also results in being unproductive. So keep everything at once on your study table which is helpful while you are studying. Like keep your water bottle on the table always so you don't have to go. Next, make an environment of what you are studying. So that you can always look up for something inspirational. And this tip is very helpful for a language learner. Now the next one is optional but if you want so you can try. The next one is make a proper schedule. I know it's difficult to follow but making a proper schedule organizes your day. And you don't have to waste time thinking what should I study next.
So get on your study table and start your work by following these tips. I hope you like this video and you find it helpful. If you have any recommendations or suggestions for the next video, so please let me know in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching. Always learn something new.